Welcome back, families. I hope you are well. I hope your day is good. Thank you so much for your time. I'm so grateful. If this is your first time, my name is Mamri, and you are very welcome. This video, once again, is about Niger. The government of Niger has put down a law to protect the young girls in the country. Yes, know that the young boys are not important, but according to him, they need to protect these young ones. We all know what is going on in the world and we have to protect them because they are the future mothers of these countries. So the government has put down law and other things into places to look after them. And he called on everyone to protect the young girls of the country. Please listen, I'll be back. Thank you so much for your time. News from Ottawa Governor A constant determination and enthusiasm equal to the challenges we face. The promotion, well-being and empowerment of young girls are key issues close to the heart of the Nigerian authorities. And for this 2024 edition, the theme chosen is Girls' Vision of the Future. A choice which, according to the minister, reflects a whole reality. A must for Niger. We felt it essential to adapt this theme to better reflect our own context and priorities. That's why we've chosen to take a more specific angle, the vision of lives for the future. Towards a Niger where the community protects, educates and empowers young girls. And fully exercise its rights. Contextualized theme, just a reminder that the future of Nigerian lives must be a central concern. Minister Gabarakini also spoke of the importance attached to the promotion of women and the protection of girls by the Nigerian authorities, the National Council for the Safeguarding of the Homeland and the Government of Niger. Under the enlightened leadership of His Excellency, Brigadier General Abdramatani firmly believes in the ability of women and girls to be vectors of change. More than ever, the commitment of girls and women is crucial to driving the social, economic and cultural transformations needed in our communities. The vision for the future of girls can only be realized through collective effort. It is with this in mind that the minister launched an appeal to all levels to get all the sons and daughters of the country involved in achieving this noble goal. By creating a real synergy around this common cause, it is possible, says the Minister of Public Health, Population and Social Affairs, to provide young girls with the conditions they need to flourish in this environment. Families, that's the good news from Niger. Yes, the government is doing what they can do to protect the young ones, which is good. These young girls are uh, the future mothers and the future leaders of the country, so they have to protect them and not only the girls, the boys as well, education wise and everything. Look how beautiful they are. That's what I was thinking. They are all beautiful and we don't want anything bad to happen to them. We want them to become good mothers, uh, good doctors, engineers, everything that they wish to be, we want them to become. And we want them to a peaceful country above all to have a place to call a country that they will be proud of. So yes, I will end this video here. God bless you all, my returning, my new. Those who just joined this family, thank you. God bless you. Like the video, share it if possible, so it will reach others to join our family. I will see you soon. Stay blessed for me, please. Credit to LTN for sharing this with us and